um, so for me, um, I always, so I moved to America 15 years ago, and I always knew that I wanted to be an American. Um, so even though I came here to go to college, and to go to, you know, I had a scholarship and all that, um, when the, I always knew that I wanted to be American, and that had nothing to do with, it had very little to do with grammar. Regardless of whether I was going to be an athlete or start running somewhere, I was always going to be an American. And so um, when the opportunity came and I waited for a really long time to be an American, in 2017 I became an American citizen. So uh, for me, it's a privilege, it's an honor. I am grateful for this great nation because it's not only by going to school and getting an education, getting a degree, and being a good athlete, because what scholarship did for me uh, allowed me to grow as an athlete, to be an Olympian, and to be a professional athlete. And with that, there was a lot of ripple effect that came from that. My family has been supported because of that. I've been able to pay for tuition for, for children back in Kenya. I've been able to support my family, my extended family. My husband and I, I have a two-year-old now. My husband and I are both Americans now, even though we're both in Kenya. So for me to be to represent this country is a privilege, it's an honor. I am I am beyond words, I couldn't even express it. It's just I am really grateful and I just wanted to I've said this so many times. Uh, I wanted to run for this great nation because of the privileges and the opportunities that this country has afforded me and my family. And the best way I can do that is to do this and do it well. And, and I just hope that I, I represent this station well. And, and this opportunity, and today to make this a big team is just a great honor. And I am, I am really going to try to represent this country well. Um, and then on the second question, um, coming back from childhood was not easy for me. Um, my daughter is three years now. But it, it took a while. It took a while a year for me to even feel like I was, you know, like my not necessarily my own self because I can't be my own self. I'm a mom and all that stuff. So I'm a better version of myself. And uh, and so it, it was a difficult process to come back. A lot of women um, have children and they come back and somehow everything clicks back and they run. And they're fantastic. But that was not my story. My story was I had difficult story. Uh, my body fell apart, I got uh, sick all the time, I couldn't put together three, I couldn't even put together a month of training while well, getting, getting fatigued and getting sick. So I have struggled. So this victory, even though I didn't win today, but I made the team to focus. Today I was victorious. I was victorious because of where I've come from. I was victorious because of the challenges that I've gone through to, to be back here. And I'm just so grateful that I'm going back to the Olympics again. Uh, but also I'm going back to the Olympics as a mom. And that is a statement by itself. So today was huge in so I couldn't even in so many ways it's absolutely amazing in so many ways. Because I have the places I have gone through, I I almost felt like quitting so many times. I had to psych myself so many times because it just felt awful to come back um, because my body was fighting. And I am grateful that I didn't um, I didn't quit. And I'm grateful for the people that held my hands and supported me, gave me opportunities, and allowed me to do this. And I am just thankful for anyone who's out there that. You know, feel like that. You know, keep it. Come together at some point. 